Hey guys, what is going on? This is iAppleGeek3, and in this video, I'm presenting you guys another top 10 tweaks list for iOS 9.3. And I'll be showing you all of these tweaks on my iPhone SE running iOS 9.3.3. Now, some of these tweaks may not be mentioned in this video because they were mentioned in a previous video, and I have that linked up here for you guys to check out if you guys want to. But anyways guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. So this tweak that you are currently seeing that makes everything extra small is called upscale. Now what this tweak lets you do is on your iPhone, as you guys can see here, it actually lets you adjust the resolution of your display to whatever you want. Right now I am on an iPhone SE and my screen looks like it's an iPhone 6. You can set your own resolution at your own risk or you can just use one of the presets. Alright, I'm back on my native resolution and now I can show you guys the next tweak. This is called Flip Control Center. It's a much more simplified version of CC settings. And it behaves very much like CC settings where you can actually customize every single toggle in here. And for some you can customize what they do if you hold on the toggle, which is really nice. Of course, you can customize all this to your liking inside of the Flip Control Center settings. Roundification will change your alert banners to a circular look and also it will change notification center and the control center to have a floating feel. This to me is a pretty thorough tweak and you should definitely check it out in Cydia. Now the next tweak is an oldie that has been around for a while, it's called Lock Screen Tool and it has a high compatibility rate with many other tweaks, that's why I love this tweak so much. You can customize your lock screen, get rid of junk that you don't want, you can literally get rid of everything on the lock screen and just have a blank lock screen and let other tweaks look good. This may not be a very large tweak feature wise, but it's very handy for getting rid of junk on the lock screen that you don't want there. Super handy lock screen tool. Better Shutdown replaces the traditional power off screen that usually comes up with a more modern menu. And it really reminds me of the Android Shutdown menu. Now you can change a bunch of things inside of the tweak settings, including the theme between the light and dark options. Now personally, I do prefer the dark, but both look great. This is Better Shutdown. Now BioProtect is a paid tweak but I do think it's worth mentioning. BioProtect allows you to lock singular applications or parts of settings or even folders to only be open upon you putting your fingerprint on the Touch ID sensor. Now Spotlight Be Gone will get rid of the spotlight search when you swipe down or when you swipe right on the home screen. Now this ties in really well with my next tweak, Mobius, which allows you to swipe indefinitely on your home screen or even inside of folders. Of course, every single aspect of these two tweaks can be customized in the settings app. Quick Volume HUD Plus allows you to customize the duration of the volume pop-up. This can be super convenient if you don't want to get rid of the pop-up altogether. Now throughout this video you may have noticed that my dock is doing some funky things. Now that is due to classic dock. But there's a twist. Classic dock has been changed since the last time I reviewed this tweak. It has now been paired with anemone which is like a modern winter board. This is really cool because you can add your own themes in here and when you hit apply you can see the preview of what your theme would look like. Right now I only have classic dock enabled and if you guys want me to do anemone themes in the future please do let me know down in the comments. And you made it. You made it to the bonus tweaks section. Today I've got two bonus tweaks for you guys. The first one is called Charge Pulse. When you plug in your device, the battery icon actually pulses in and out to indicate that your device is charging. This is much better than the itty bitty lightning bolt that you would normally get. And last but not least, we have 8 alerts, which allows you to get the old iOS 8 alert style back versus the roundish style found on devices running iOS 9 or later. Anyways guys, that is all I have for you in this video. If you guys want more of these videos, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you have any suggestions for tweaks, do leave them in the comments. I am open to suggestions. I hope you guys do enjoy all of these Cydia tweaks on your device. And until next time, peace.